Lily with Keller Williams Realty here in Portland, Oregon. So I got this question yesterday from a client and I thought it was a really interesting one. It's one I believe I have answered before, probably around the same time last year, but it's definitely a good one to readdress which is, is the winter a good time to buy a home? So a lot of people get the idea of, well, we wanna buy a house, probably should wait until the spring and summer. Now that's when you're gonna have the highest level of inventory of homes and therefore the most options available. While that is true to some degree, you also have to consider that that is the time when most other people are out looking and are most serious about buying a property. So that's when you're in turn going to get the most uh, competition for homes. And then also the sellers that are out there right now, the sellers that are willing to put their home on in the winter and deal with the weather and all of that are going to be the most motivated sellers in my opinion. So for just those reasons right there, that kind of takes away part of the inventory thing because if you are willing to deal with the rain and cold and potential snow and all of that and go out for look, looking for homes, yes, there'll maybe be less homes on the market, but there'll be less other buyers out there to compete with, which could be really beneficial. And then the main reason I like to bring up buying in the winter is here in Portland and in the Pacific Northwest in general, one thing we deal a lot with in homes is moisture. Big issue when it comes to many inspection reports, things that come up are moisture issues. So when you go and look at a home in the winter, when it's maybe been raining for the last few days and water has been seeping in in any particular way, you're more likely to find that. And more importantly, your inspector is more uh, likely to find those issues. So if there's any leaks in the home, if there is any drafts, any just like kind of cold staleness in the home, you'll find that. And then most importantly, you're more likely to find any mold issues. So I find it's actually a really great time to view properties. That's a really good time to look at basements and crawl spaces and attics. Um, so those are the big tips I think of when you are looking to buy a property. I actually think here it's an incredible time to look for homes. And then the last part of that I will say actually as well is it's also a good time to look when it, or okay, I'll say it this way. When you're looking at it, looking at houses in the spring and summer, a lot of the time, you know, that's when a house is going to look its best. If you're going to an open house or you're looking at a home with a, a real estate agent, the home is going to be bright and sunny. There's going to be flowers outside. Everything's going to look nice. You're going to think, oh my God, this house has amazing light. You know, it's so hard in the winter with lack, the lack of light in our current house. This house is beautiful. What you don't realize is maybe the house has amazing light because it's the summer. Maybe the house itself actually doesn't have that many windows. Maybe it's uh, covered by a giant tree that you're not really realizing in that moment. So when you go look at a house in the winter, it sounds bad, but you're kind of looking at it at its worst. <laughs> like you're looking at it not at its shiniest, which sounds bad, but in the reality of it, that's when I want you as my client to see a home. I want you to see a home when hopefully it still speaks to you and you still think it's a lovely place that you'd want to live in and you know shelter away during the cold and winter but i want you to see it for its reality of what it really is and the winter is a great time for that and yeah so i hope that makes sense to you i hope um gosh i probably think of like five other tips on this subject but don't want to make super long videos so if you have any more questions on this topic if you have any questions in general for me, please feel free to uh, send me over a message. I could easily make a video about this of uh, why to sell in the winter as well. So if you're someone that's thinking of selling, feel free to reach out to me. I can either make that video or have a conversation with you specifically. My comment, or sorry, my uh, contact information will be below and then uh, feel free to send me a message as well on whatever um, platform you're watching this on.